Okay, so plan was to carry on uh, preparing the ground today, get a bit of the base down. It's pissing down. Check the forecast the rest of the day. It's pissing down. So um, I'll do what I can, see how far I can get. Um, so I'll basically carry on now until I get piss wet through or bored or pissed off or both. Right, so I've taken the um, top soil off. Just gonna rake this down, flatten it out, and then start putting the gravel on. Okay, so I've taken the uh, the top layer of the grass now, leveled it off a little bit, stuck some pegs in the ground so I know they're all level. Uh, next step, a bit of weed killer, put that down, and then some gravel, flat it out a bit, followed by the membrane. My only concern now is that I've taken off too much. Um, the garden's really uneven, so I put some uh, wooden stakes down, the one in the top corner over there. Is only about an inch at the ground. Where's the one down here? It's about eight inches. That's quite a lot of gravel I've got to put down. Um, I suppose I could put the mug back, but that's a bit. <laughs> I shouldn't have dug it up in the first place. But having said that, I'm it's probably better off. I've got compact gravel underneath the base than soft mud anyway. Um, I think what I'll do is I'll uh, put the weed killer down now, just kill any weeds, and then I'll just stop putting a layer of gravel down and see what happens. If it looks like I'm using way too much gravel, I might have to come back and rethink this. So I've covered just over half now with the gravel. Um, I still got to get about height because it's not quite up at that peg in the middle there, and the uh, the deep beat bit is over there. I've gone through about half the gravel that I bought. Um, I may have to get some more because uh, when I put the plastic base down, you have to fill that in with the gravel as well. So, and when I start walking over this and compressing it down, it's going to lose some height as well. So, uh, I think I've had enough this weekend. So, I'm going to upload this video, pack it in, probably have a beer, and then. Uh, next weekend then finish this piece off. I'll probably order some wood in fact before next weekend so I'll, I'll finish this piece off maybe midweek you know in the evenings or something and then possibly start putting down the uh, I'll put on the plastic base on Saturday that shouldn't take too long up in the thought. Oh, I might have said that I've got a wheelbarrow in tons of uh, gravel again. Nice. Now I've had some comments about my choice of booze yesterday from James, my mate James. Nothing wrong with Cause Light. This is an awesome drink, especially in the summer. Absolutely awesome. Anyway, spend the weekend. Uh, you've seen the video, see what I've done. Um, not as far as I wanted to be, but at least I've got a lot of the sort of the donkey work out of it, digging up the garden. That, that was a bit I was really dreaded. <clears throat> I'm looking forward to buying the wood and starting to put it together and seeing the shared form. Um, I mean it was pretty bad sort of digging up um, out in that wet 
and you know rain in all day long but um, at least the soil was nice and soft it had been better off than me doing it in uh, in the summer I guess when it had been too hard so at least now I've got a little bit more gravel to put down um, next Saturday I'm going to put the, the plastic base down fill that with gravel and hopefully start putting some wood down on the Sunday or at least ordering some um, I think once I start, once I start getting the wood together and starting to put it together, I think it'll all just it'll go up relatively quickly. I think, but having said that, I'm doing it on my own as well, and so, like all these things, it's it's not easy doing these jobs on your own. Uh, right, so anyway, I'm off. Quick Emma call of duty. A few more calls light, James, and I'll uh, see you soon.